after Mang Song's lesson yesterday. Crazy find, if only we needed it still. Let's see what today's got for us. Yeah, 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 they've got the all the packs there on the site. Whoa, 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 whoa! Put on your energy shield. <laughs> Classic, uh, forgotten energy shield. Greetings, hello, hello. Uh, I mean, I guess if we're on player's eight, we can pop chest as well. Thalber dropped? Ah, yes, my favorite rune word, Thalber. How could we all forget? My favorite rune of the bunch. Um, yeah, it's not actually like the best zone. It's okay. If we get popped by some ghosts could be troublesome. A gear we use, and nothing too crazy on her. Infinity, Griffins, Maras, bunch of lightning skillers. My source instead of Barb? I don't really like the Barb in the uh, Arcane Sanctuary. But I mean, we'll, we'll do some barb as well. Like, I'm just, I'm just kind of bouncing around between characters as I desire. Ah, Cathan's Mask, the GG drop we've been waiting for. She's lower MF. She's only like 150 MF or something like that. Honestly, I should probably put a little bit more in her charms. Snag a couple charms from someone else. It's probably a smart move. But she's mostly just a like fast player's eight killer. So she goes for high quantity kill. Get a lot of drops. While having enough magic find to still, you know, hit things. So, she does that right. Exactly. She's more of a rune finder, honestly. Sh Shale rune. So, that's why for, like, Arcane Sanctuary, she's pretty solid, because she can blast Ghost down on players 8 pretty quickly. Hmm, where's the bosses at? What the shale? I know. Enemies line up nicely in Arcane? Somewhat. I think I'm gonna be cold source for ladder start for my team. Um, I actually need to figure out Tomorrow, PD2 ladder start. I feel like I need to figure out team for that. Also, if you ever want Sunder Charms, 
They're all right here. So many senders. Dull rune. Ornate plate. Like I said, like 150. She she's really low MF. There's definitely a couple places I can do a little bit, and since it's so low, I probably should just like change out a couple charms for some seven MFers. Gear wise, I can't change a lot of pieces. Belt I need. I could change the SOJ if I want and just put a 30 Nagel on. That might be not bad, but 25% max mana with, eh, maybe that's worth more to me, having the max mana. Yeah, probably. Trex can definitely be changed out. That's one that I don't really need. I need the strength right now, but for spirit, I think. Oh no, I don't even need it for spirit. Okay, so those should be war traps. Ah, uh, but I need the poison res. Crap. Yeah, man. Everything on this character is so specifically needed. Every time I look at tricks, I'm always like, why am I using tricks? Oh, look, you just found a prime sub on the ground. Wow. It's crazy how it just fell there. Crazy. Thanatos, thank you. You have a heart attack now? Sorry to hear that. Don't forget to call 911. 5% MF. Man. Yeah, this gear, the, the really the place I would get more MF is I'd swap out a couple of lightning skillers. Just for likes, MF charms. Probably the best way. Thank you for the prime sub. 911 or 999 or 011899988199919725 for emergency services. Lucky, are you in my chat? Perfect. Do you have a team already set for tomorrow and or do you have a spot open? Yeah, but PD2 ladder is tomorrow. But D2R ladder is 28th. You got me covered. It will be with Jim most likely. If there's another spot, we could probably get Senpai in as well. And he can give us all the hacks. But if not, all good.
Yeah, Zod is Zod is a rough find. You asked Senpai, he said he's busy. Yeah, I might be able to convince him. But only if there's space and whatnot. I always find the sick finds when you're not recording. Mmm, a likely story. Your character editor of heroes finds some really nice stuff, huh? I'm doing PD2 launch. We are. Where can I take you? Perfect. There's spots for both. All right. Message him and say you have spots for both him and myself. And Llama says, do the needful. He'll know what it means. Hey, Jim. Also, you asked Senpai, but you didn't ask me? Now I'm offended. Y'all in trouble. Uh, cathedral catacombs. Hmm, very good area. Do I want to take it on this character, though? Oh, boy. Probably not. I probably want my blizzard sorceress. Just go high magic find and go to... Okay. Let's... This is, this is the thing. I don't even think we do any of the area. I think we just straight rush. Um, sure, you go there. Straight rush and Dario with our blizzard source. Oh. And let's That's go to players fun. three. Thank you, Spasty. Hurry, hurry, hurry! It's the perfect area. Oh my god, my map is garbage. Might just reset this map. Cada studded leather. I'm gonna reset it, that's a terrible map. Uh, this source is 92, the other one's 94. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? What's this garbage? Absolutely atrocious map. Come on, Tyrios, mate! Actually, hold up. Let's go, let's go. Give me a quickie.
Not horrible, not great. If this level's good, then we're good. Alright. It's a little bit better. Not amazing, but it works. Bardiche. It's a large charm. How many Templars? Only one! Which is crazy, because I found like two Mang Songs, two Death Webs. Yeah, I'm going to play Friday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Yeah. Terrorized bosses getting TCA7 is kind of lame. I actually do kind of agree. She is insanely good. Like, too good. Super Devil, thank you. Does it feel bad finding two Mang songs and looking back on how you just found the one? Oh yeah, I mean, two Mang songs, two death webs, but I've only got one Templar's Might. It took me forever to find a Mang song before. I mean, I knew my odds were terrible though on on that. That last find was was really bad. It took way too long for Mang songs. I found so many like doubles and triples of everything, if not more. No, it doesn't actually improve the uh, drop. We thought it might have before, but it doesn't. Shadow plate. Dark Waiter, thank you. With two gifted subs. Super Devil 666. And Spastican with the sub. Just doing players three. That generally, for the most part, will get us everything we need. We still kill at a pretty good spot. Running 450 MF. I kind of want to run even more Magic Find, uh, but I would need to go and trade some of the charms off from my Barbarian. Like, I could easily boost this to about seven, 800 magic find. So maybe I should do it while we have Indariel. It's been like a minute or two. Tiara. Okay, let's, let's go. Do it all. Ninjas. War Tribes. 49s. What War Tribes do I have on my blue source? <sighs> Dark Waiter with a T2 sub! Oops. Wow. Probably don't need that friend Dario either. Okay, we did that. Oh, this is, I need the strength. Oh boy, uh, hold on, I have a 10 FCR. 20, no, where's the strength, where's the strength? Where is that ring? It's on my light source, I think. Shrines are AOE. Can't even hog it anymore. Thanks, Mboro. So 
Where's the ring at? Are you kidding? Is it over here? That's just 20 to strength without FCR. FCR. Oh my god. I don't have a 10 FCR strength ring. I have so many rings with 20 strength, but none of them have FCR. I'm dying here. All right, so I guess we just won't have boots and we'll just go here and this puts us at 448. 628. Hmm. So I'm missing 50 there. Where am I missing the rest? Where am I missing the rest? I feel like that's lower than it's supposed to be. Nagel, triple towels is good, spirit, charms. Uh, why is my magic find so low? Your car keys. You get the shorter. Okay. To put in my car so I can go somewhere. Okay. What? Okay. Have a nice time. Ooh, ring. Come on, baby. Big money. It's a nice raven. It's a nice raven, at least. What class am I playing? I don't know. I'm open to anything. Holy sword looks kind of fun, doesn't it? Three five die cold. But I don't know if it's any good. And I, I I can really be whatever though. We're just playing whatever we want. Okay. What seems like a fun, interesting class to play? Yes, 23 hours for PD2 ladder reset. She can drop anything at all. Mithril coil. Putty, please, thank you. Holy fire charge. Kisses hard heart. Only a twelve percent Iratha is angelic. Thank you, Daddy. Thank you, Putty. Appreciate you guys. And reminding everybody they may have a Twitch Prime subscription. You can use it here, you can use it wherever you want, just make sure you use it. But I do appreciate those who spend it in the chat. Thorns Golem Manster. Is that fun? I want something that I can do like some good endgame content with, you know, like have fun. That's why I was messing around with the Throw Barbarian in the testing and throw barb was great so but i want to be able to like do you know the mapping and all that and it'd be all right fanged knife 
freezing arrows on. Is that solid Ooh. there? Hot meat sauce, thank you. Don't do terror, just do Nightmare and Dario. Yeah, hey, you'll get it. It'll be, you know, hard, but you'll get it. Charge Strike Fend Amazon. That sounds fun. Other meta? What do you mean other meta? Come on, where's Cheerios Might? Sounds like Senpai's in. Nice. Photo! I was just thinking about you. I got back over 1800. After being silly, playing dumb. Ow, move. Another unique ring. Come on, big money. Ah. I was like, we got to get our training program rolling. I'm ready for it. I'm ready to train, photo. We've got Dwarf and Raven so far. Hell yeah, you in? Let's go. Let's do it. I'm ready for 2,000. I'm, I'm tired of being stuck at 1,700, 1,800. Because I still feel horrible at chess. I think that's the biggest issue. But then again, I watch Akaru and he's always like, oh, I'm so bad at chess. And so it seems like that never changes. It seems like you always feel like you're garbage. <laughs> But yesterday I played a game. Wow, second mythical coil. Straight up just hung my queen. I just moved it right next to his queen. Nothing defending it. I just moved it there. And you know what happened? He didn't even take it. He thought his queen was suddenly under threat and he put a rook right between it. So then I just moved my queen out of the way and then I won and I was like, doesn't even feel good. Doesn't even feel good to win when we're both so terrible at this game. Absolutely felt horrible. Botez Gambit and it was declined. Nice dark. But, you know, I've hung my queen before. You know, once, once every other day I feel like I give my queen away for free. But a lot of times it's at least through, you know, okay, there was a pin I didn't see or something. Or, you know, whatever. Wow, a rare Archon staff. But this was just straight up, I put, I put my queen right next to his queen. Yeah, like, alright, I missed the fork, you know, it's like, eh, 
these things happen and you feel like garbage, but man, it, it feels really rough when you just straight up hand your queen to them on a platter. Stop looking for Meng songs. I know! Playing the new scene. Yes, I am. Thank you, Power Us. Appreciate it. Yeah. Uh, self wield infinity is really nice for Nova Source. The minus 55 light res, if you get that. Which I believe mine is a perfect minus 55. Oh, it's minus 53. Close enough. The online one I rolled was minus 55. So yeah, I'm like, I don't know. But at the same time, I feel like, you know, doing my puzzles every day and that stuff. I don't know. I'm not, I'm, I don't feel like it's, it's quite enough. I still feel like I'm, I'm still too stupid and I need to like study something else to figure out how to get better. Do some ASMR. Maybe I should tag my stream as ASMR then. Feral claws. Chess is impossible. It's true. You've been playing since 11 and still have issues? Infinity self filled light trap assassin? No. I have not tried that one. It gets to the point where you need to stay. It's hard to self diagnose. Exactly. Exactly, it's just, it's hard to diagnose why I suck, I just know I suck. Third unique ring! This one's the... New team? Wait, what team? Three unique rings! Come on, Bull Cathos and Wisp, where are you at? Still, three unique rings and about... Less than 20 minutes, honestly. It's pretty nice. Should give us a couple more chances. At what level do you need to be for her to drop griffins? You probably just need to be 85 would be my guess, right? Get her 87 and you should be good. Level 91? No way. It doesn't need to be area level 93 to drop griffins. Unique ring again! <gasps> Gah! Can Griffins drop in area level 83s? Maybe, yeah. I don't even think you need exactly the 87. She has extra chances at TC87s at character level 91. But uh, Griffins isn't TC87, right? Griffins is TC84? Diadem, diadem. Is it 87? Eh, it might be 87. Eh, I might just miss the yellow circlet. It is 84? Okay. Thresher. Not a. Braviathan of the Brocian, thank you very much.
Do I change my, no. This is actually the time set that it is Andariel. I, I don't I don't change my PC clock to always run in Dario. TCA seven kilo eighty four. Okay. Planning on Pally? Sure, Paladin sounds fine. Pally or if we do the uh, wild golem necro could be fun, but I don't know how fun that is versus how boring it is. I think Paladin's got a lot of fun options. I mean, I just, it's probably all right, but Crescent Moon, is really nice there. Hmm. Oof, tough one, Bubba. Yeah, Pendle's pretty solid at dropping. Griffins. That's true. Uh, yeah, I, d I don't know. Probably okay, but. Do you buy Hero Editor? No, if you do exclamation mark I G H E. There's actually a Diablo 2 mod that Warren built, uh, one of my mods, and it has um, full hero editing capabilities right there within the game. So you're not even having to use an external program or anything. Just within the mod, you just like, you know, cube things and do whatever and you can get all the items you want. Wow, so many things. Looking for the items on the left there. Man, I've probably found like 30 griffins in my career. Honestly, once you really start going after item hunting, like, oh, tons and tons, you start finding just so many griffins and COAs and all sorts of crazy stuff. And you realize like, Tyrael's might, Mang Songs, like these are the crazy items that Like, I have two Tyrael's Mites in my career, one Zod Rune, crazy, um, two Astrians, four or five, probably five Deathwebs. And then everything else, at least ten plus. Even like Death Fathom and stuff, I have tons of Death Fathoms.
I haven't looted a GG Fool's weapon. Didn't check for Tal's Ami. I've got too many of those as well. I have not found a 32020. I've definitely found like 3XX before, but not a perf 32020. Oh, Deathweb is amazing. I think I've done a tier list of every item in the game. If you look up like Mr. Lamas tier list, probably just like unique gloves, unique whatever, blah blah blah, then I think I run through all of those uh, different items. Prior to Sunders, I mean, it doesn't change a ton. Probably changes a little bit. I have, I have found a 25 before. I've also found a 24 and a 19.5 and lots of combinations very similar to such. So that one I've actually found a bit about. Green sacred armor. Brutal. We're at 648, 628 MF right now, something like that. Oh, uh, okay, I just, I just realized where I'm lacking some of it. So if I go, yeah, okay. I, re I just remembered I have spirit on my offhand instead of uh, a four-isted monarch shield. So I'm missing 100 MF from that. And then I'm missing the 50 MF from my war traps because I don't have strength for some reason. I don't have a good rare FCR strength magic find ring. I need to get one of those for this character. And then I'm missing probably just a little bit in some charms. And that's where the difference is. I was like, how am I so much lower? Only six. 50 MF. Do Terrazones make it easier to complete Grail? Yeah, because TC87s are, are better there. So. Honestly, the best way to find J mods is perfect gems and just keep re rolling. Even then, it's still like 1 in 12,000 chance, so good luck, but. Kind of gives you something. It was 12k, yeah. I think like 12,100 or something. Now, my math might have been wrong, but that's what I calculated. Eldritch Orb. But, yes, Terra Zones also make it way less boring for the high items because you're not just stuck on the same trash. Whoa! 32020. Wow! And 29 energy. Almost like a a, a punch in the face. You're going to be one off full perfect. Almost a punch in the face. Hey, we got BK sword. Dang. That's sick though. 320, 20, 29. Uh. 
What a cool find. Need to make some sort of uh, fire light hybrid that utilizes a 32020. So we gotta figure out. Dr. Lovsky, thank you. Yeah, that's, that's a pretty, pretty cool one. I've found three 2030s before, but not three 202030s. Wow. Wand. That's crazy, finding Torch of Iroh here. Aw, oh, thanks, Dr. Lovsky. Appreciate that. That's crazy rare to drop Torch of Iroh on Helen Dario. One of those nutso TC3 items that can take a long time to find. Like I have Nell Striker still waiting, but I'm pretty sure Torch of Ira is even more rare than Nell Striker. Can I greed the Griffin? I don't need another Griff. I already got a few of them. Vesper, thank you. Appreciate the five months. What I need is materials. Or one of these items on the list. Dang, Predator. That's amazing. I'm going to be really sad if Endarial Hour goes by and we don't find one item off our list there with eight items still. So many unique rings. One in 4,000 chance for Torch of Iron to drop Hell Andy. I thought it would be even more rare, honestly. Did spend a few minutes finding a better map. Yeah, we spent a few minutes finding a better map and finding and upping our magic find by like 200 something. I think worth it. I thought Grail can be completed in one hour on Terra's and Andy. No, but she has really good drops. Terra's can be one kill away. I know. That's why I'm trying to get there as fast as I can. You're us. Uh, so many uniques have dropped, including some good ones. Cutlass, Ogre Mall. Nice. I got a 3-5 cold facet. Why not kill elites on the way? And Dariel's too precious, man. Time spent killing all the elites when I could be killing Endariel. Spired Helm. Let's see, which one? Which one do you think, you guys? Which one is it? Nightwings or Veil of Steel? I think I have a 13 or 14 Nightwings. I think it's 14 actually. 
IO staff. There you go. No, I haven't dropped night wings in a little bit. Ah! Bummer. Ring ring, banana phone. Man catcher, I need one of those in my life. Are these items good or just rare? Wisp is good, Haas is good. BK ring is good. The other stuff is pretty much just rare. Yeah, I've tried obsession. Little fire fire obsession. Astrians is decent, choices. but grief Don't over September of the powered it. Sub Mr. Lama think. Choices, choices. Thank you, Paladine. Hundred FCR Nova Source. Uh huh. I really like 200 FCR, but it also is like a little too fast sometimes, you know. But I use it if I want to like key farm. It can be really nice. You also just got Veil of Steel. <laughs> so yeah, 105. Pretty solid. Tiro's my can drop in six runs. I don't believe you. Ow! Amulet. Tiara as well. Nightwing's one of your hardest finds. Yeah, in my first grail, I'm pretty sure I found like seven Veil of Steels before Nightwings or something crazy. I just could not find Nightwings to save my life. Even though it's a 50-50 chance between them. Sorry, Primo. Noke is in. Brutal. What's the base of Executioners? Glorious Axe. Which, again, crazy. Crazy, like, uh, easy to find. Absolutely insane I haven't found that or Gargoyle's Bite. Those two I still, like, don't believe. That's just dumb to me. I find those all day, every day, normally. Extra baby money? Bro, baby's, baby's so expensive. No, the, the donate link is... is... The, one of the best ways if you're just looking for a one-time. Because that has only the fee of PayPal, which is, you know, 5 to 10%, whatever it ends up being overall. It's not bad. That'd be nice, Kirchhoff.
Legend Spike. Wow. I already have Ghost Flame though. The wrong TC87's dropping, man. It's the wrong one. I do like wing decks. Wish it was ethereal. Good day. The unique bow with freeze and knockback. Glorious X! Let's go! I told y'all! I told y'all! Like candy! Drops like candy! Easy! Call the shot! Let's go, baby! Executioner's Justice off the list. Now, Gargoyle's Bite, you're the next one. Come on, baby. I mean, Tyrael's might sound lovely as well, but... I don't even care about that. Leave the charm. Sacred Armor. Whoo! It's really a cool item. Like... Minus target defense, 30 IAS, chance to cast Decrepify, 25% chance crushing blow. It just isn't quite good enough. Two-handed weapons, you know, just... It's also on an axe there. But... Woo! Yeah, Fury Druid could have fun with it. Bards could dual wield them? Oh my god, that'd be cool. Even then, still probably doesn't beat out dual grief. <laughs> Heroes might sucks. Yeah, it's we talked about it before. It's just missing. It's got so many nice stats on it actually, but it's missing the god stats. You know, like FCR plus to skills, Thunder Maul. Oh my god. TC eighty seven heaven. I already have the Thunder Mauls though. Wow, which one do you think that is, you guys? Cranium Basher or Earthshaker? Shifter, excuse me. Earthshaker is a... Uh, Different weapon. Whatever you call that weapon. Cranium Basher is also an item I really love, but again, just a two hander that doesn't quite do it. I'll, I'll update items found today after Terra Zone and Dariel. And then Winged Harpoon is Gargoyle's Bite, right? I 
can't believe that's its base. Wow, hard leather armor. Yeah, I can't waste time during power hour. This is the best zone for finding your GG items. I'm glad we uh, added that extra wire fleece as Gladiator Spain. Extra magic find to the character. I'm so happy it hit catacombs, man. That's fantastic. Just a cool trophy. I mean, I think there's a difference, like, if they had materials might be just like, you know, a really good item. It doesn't have to be so ungodly ridiculous that a build can't work without it, you know? But just something that just gives a little, a little extra on top of Ford or Enigma or whatever you would normally have in that spot. be really nice yeah it's it's not even one change away yeah Jalal's like plus two skills or plus teleport still doesn't do enough for it still needs a little more of the big power affixes Unique ring! Second time! Let's go! Sorry about that. My microphone was just like too loud. Discord took control of it and made it crazy. Happens. You got your Myrmidon Greaves? Nice. Discord loves to take control of it and just jack it up to be so loud. Right in the middle of Indarial Terror Zone.
<sighs> All right, Terra Zone. Terra Zone. Let's go. Terrials might. We'll put it in the items found after this zone ends. Hammered in or Blissor start. I mean, they're both solid, but without Enigma, no teleport, you know. A little more limited with the hammered in just to start till you get something there. Yeah, we got executioners. Shop music DMCA. No, it's free use, but I don't know if I could use it commercially. Generally, a lot of things at that point have. Requirements. Venom grip. Once you sell a product, a lot of uh, free things no longer become free. They want in on that. Dry spell. <laughs> Except for chat GPT. Isn't chat GPT just getting worse and worse? Yes. Razor bow, kraken shell. It would be funny, Dolian. Of course, Dark Sider. I think it's an icon that you select, Dark, if I'm not mistaken. Lich Wand again. Nice, there is. Foe plus Traps and Duo. Oh, that'll be super strong. Trapson already really strong, Foden really strong in certain areas, but the Conviction Aura for the Trapson, godly. Come on. Hey, that pushed us to 99% of the Grail done as well. Let's go, baby. 98 to 99. How many SOJs have I found? Oh, a lot. I don't know exactly. I mean, it is like kind of rare-ish, you know, overall. Yellow knots, thank you. Ooh, nice predator. But... Yeah, I'm just waiting for a buzz beater uh, Astrians here.
Uh, one more. Do that, Nakora. Especially the fact I haven't found Tyrells yet is the really brutal part. One more, one more, one more! Come on! Come on! Just get there! Alright. Last one. Ah. Storm shield. And let's see what we have here though. Ah, oh, gross. Alright, what's the zone? Ancient's way. Alright, so, items found. God, she just dropped so many things. Executioners... Justice... Grail. Um, then we found... Cranium Basher! Nice! Ghost Flame... Veil of Steel... 204. Uh, 3 5 cold facet. Two times Raven Frost. There weren't war travelers. Were there battle boots? I didn't see any. I know, non eth. The wand? What, Torch of Iroh? Yeah, those are... I, I didn't leave battle boots. I, I'm pretty certain. Clip it if I did. Oh, three 20 Ashutas. That's right. Yeah, we'll do that in a second. Let me just get some stuff over here. Sure. 
Okay, let's just do that for now. I prefer Nova Blizzard to start. Dual Leech Ring with 10 MF, but not a ton else. Nice Dual Leeches on it, though. Oh, she already has War Traps. Okay. Um, let's go here, here, here. And let me do this really fast. I need to get rid of all those as well. So many trash things to get rid of. Ah, I think it still just ends up being more of a gimmick overall. Ancient Sway, Icy Cellar. Okay, and seven items remaining. Goodbye, Executioner's Justice. Yeah, I just have some random treks on right now. So I have 214 light res, so I don't actually need all this light res. Dress. I don't need. Skills, cold skills. And that puts us at four fifty three. That's good enough. Nasty though. I can't carry anymore. Probably need to run the damage honestly instead. Switch to mosaic. Now this is just a bad area for Blizz Source players eight, especially a low damage Blizz Source.
I just wanted to level up really fast. Yeah, the uh, Terra's on Andy will do that. She's quite nice. Wow. It's back to back right there. Those are Sunder Charms, not Jeeds. They just rain down. Do I think Mosaic is fun? Nah. It's too much. It needs to be adjusted down. We also found two uh, unique method coils as well today. And five unique rings we found. 16 life, 28 light res. Nice. Cold Sunder, Magic Sunder. I guess I need my mercenary. Afternoon. Yeah, this is this is a Tough for us to not get popped on players eight. Goal rune, hello. Hello. Don't mind if I do. Golrun is one of those just nice, you know, it's a simple find. It's not doing anything crazy for you, but... Hey, half of X rune? Sure, I'm not going to say no to that. It makes mosaic now, I suppose, so it actually is then one of the best runes ever. Sadly. Yeah, Mosaic was just too OP. It was just too good, and because of that, it wasn't fun. On top of it, like, blinding you half the time and stuff as well. So yeah, I guess the question was asked, can something feel too good that it's not fun? And the answer is yes. Yes, it can. Hello. This is really hard on this player count. I'm just, I'm gonna go to players one. It's, it's just too much on players eight. Too many cold immunes and stuff, so even when you break them, they're just really hard to deal damage to. I think a lot of people feel similarly about Hammerdens, and yet Mosaic makes Hammerdens look like garbage. Hammerdens were able to, you know, do players, hey, Saigon Saigons, like 64, but then they started struggling. 
Mosaic Assassin just kept going. She did, she was doing players 2,000. What is wrong with my mercenary? Why does he suck so much right now? I mean, like, yes, it's souls, and souls aren't fun, but good lord. Too cowardly to fight souls? I mean, that's probably just considered smart. Yes, if we're being honest. It was always good, but man, did they really just give it everything. Whoa! Man. No! Afternoon. It's smart to not fight souls. I have 75, I mean, more. Oh my God, the souls as well. Or the dolls! Souls and dolls? Okay, let's uh, let's go get it. We'll, we'll do it smart this time. Now I've got so much experience sitting there, I have to go get it all. It's just like such a bad angle to try and hit stuff from. Like the souls are down at the bottom of the screen, which are so hard to hit. Shoot, why would you run there? Uh, rip experience, man. Like, this is the worst angle to have to try and tackle these guys from. Good lord, that damage is insane. Ah, so much experience recovered. Okay, saved it. Gross. Ooh. Sounds like you have some good options there. Oh. 
Hello there, Mr. L. Smiley Face. Hello. Been watching the YouTubes again and learning Hammerdon and Singer. Nice. Singer is so fun. Singer is one of my favorites. Unfortunately, like, end, end, end game, it's, you know, a little slow still. Like, it's not going to be in that godly crazy range, but... Oh, I should put my cold res back up, because I was looking at my resistances without Sunder. Okay, so those charms I will want. The Gross 15 gifted a tier 1 sub to Shishuo. Thank you, Gross. Appreciate the gifted sub. And thank you, Yellow Knots and Jumping. It is sad that we have three Diablo games now since Diablo 2 came out. And they are Diablo 3, 4, and Immortal. There is an 800% bonus if you use your credit card correctly in Immortal. That is a good point. Fair point. Snakes, dolls, souls. Man, they really just put all the bad stuff down here. I don't know why they made Icy Cellar so horrible. The reason you usually skip this terror zone? Yeah, I mean, again, that's definitely the smart thing to do here. It's a horrible terror zone. <laughs> Wow! It's too, like, tight in there as well. T7, 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 N, T7, N, T7, N, T. All you do is lose experience by running this terror zone, man. That's it. I don't currently have any heal promotion stuff, so that's, uh... She's only 92, so it's not a big deal, but, but I appreciate you coming in and asking. That really means a lot. Yes, warrior. And then even here, like, the temptresses, so you get cursed. Like, oh my god. Already he's dead. Why can my mercenary not survive this zone at all? Ah! 
Nothing touched me! Oh my god, there was a little doll there I couldn't see. That's what touched me. I'm just like... My dude is just standing still, refusing to do anything. Throwing for content, yeah. Ugh, God. I just wanted to get some experience on this character. I didn't even want to do this character in this zone. Zone sucks. I'm done. Yeah, it's, it's just like bad in every way possible for this character. Let's go, Barbie. I'll put that to good use. Oh yeah, I stole all of your stuff actually. Hold on, there's a lot more I gotta give back. Uh-huh. Next zone is Trav. I actually don't love Trav for Barb. I don't know. Whirlwind Barb and stuff, I like it more. Okay, my fire reds kind of sucks. Don't have any good fire. Oh, five life, 11 fire res. Maybe I just run that. Over a 6%. Get like a little bit. Yeah, I could also just put a dwarf on. That also would work. Lord, Midora snakes and death lords. I mean, this actually is the worst mob spawns in this game. Hands down. No contest. There is every terrible mob is in here. And they're combinations as well that make them even worse. Wow. 
Like, you forget just how bad it is. That's amazingly horrible. Straight up. Oh yeah, Snapchip is like nothing. He is the only easy thing about the Icy Cellar. Everything else is literally one of these mobs. Succubus, who will amp damage you. Dolls. Souls. Vipers. Snakes. Or Death Lords. That is the combination of the mobs. It's amazing. Oh, there's abominables. Which are also horrible, but probably less of the uh, horror variety. But still, all the stunning from them. Wow, I didn't realize Ghost as well spawned in here. Man, they have a lot. There's a lot more mobs spawning in here than I thought. T3! 18 months, welcome back. Two llamas of the round. Thank you for your generosity. It is nice to have you. And you've been a great addition to the mod team. Sorry, we have to do the T3 song when someone T3 subs. San Francisco Giants tonight? Is that a joke? But do they cover? No. The joke is the Cowboys? You wish. This is their year. I've been trying to tell you guys. Nobody was listening. Now, people finally are listening. I've had Cowboys ranked one in my power rankings for so long now with this season. Moo, September is a prime time to sub to Lama. Moo, hazardous, thank you. That is true. That is true. Oh yeah, that's the thing. Terra Zone and Dariel is so good. I, I, I mean, I, I can't even begin to actually describe just how good it is in relation to any other area. Now, obviously this area sucks, but 
Even if this is, you know, a normally decent area, it don't matter. Terra's on Mephisto is also solid now with the change, but still, Terrazona and Dariel is best, I believe. Ouch, that hurt. For experience, this place is great if you don't die. Yeah, okay. How do you not die down here? I just lost 4,000 life in a single poke from some spear ladies. We found Fathom two days ago. Oh, that's right. Also these guys, which I hate. Then we found... Mang Songs yesterday. Today we found Executioner's Justice and Whisper BK. What is that? Our sixth or our seventh unique ring today? That's failed. Two dwarfs, two manolds, two ravens. I believe that's all, so I think six. Four hundred ninety-three MF, but I usually hit on swap, so six hundred and seventy-three MF. Oh my god. They won't leave. Where's the boss? There he is. Just terrible. Middles! What's up? Oh boy. Uh, yeah, I'm getting out of the middles of this. Get it? Because. Okay. They got it. Hello! How is your stream? Hope you had a nice time. Cedar bow again. What's the best class in build? Mosaic Assassin. It's a martial arts assassin is the best build in the game. Which is pretty funny if you haven't played in a long time. Because you're like, what? That's a joke of a class. But they added one rune word in there. Thanks, Middles. And it changed everything. <laughs> but your eyes, you will burn your eye sockets out. So just get ready for that. 
I farmed uh, level 99 with with it, and uh, I I had to go to the eye doctor after and get them to fix my eyes up. They said I had done something called irreparable damage, whatever that means. It was uh, some fancy, you know, doctor speak, so you know you don't actually know what they're saying. It's kind of like when you go to the dentist and they're like, "I need a, you know, three on the A25 and two on the 26," and you're like, "Whatever that means." Yes, she is also most powerful and best for Ubers as well. She's just... Every, everywhere she looks, she is the best. <laughs> Lightning traps are actually really solid because they gave them a little buff. I mean, light source will kill a little faster, but being able to You know, use item find. So good. Hardcore kicks in with light traps. Sounds fun. Really the nice thing about these zones is they have all the evil urns, so it's a great way to get some extra bosses. Six hundred eighty three MF. up well. Can't wait to refarm Mosaic again because it's best build. I just can't do it. It's just too good to me now where I can't have fun with it, you know. Kraken shell. That's it's just at that point. It's too good. So I just gotta stay away from it. Stay away from it, otherwise I'll play it and then I won't enjoy the game anymore. You know. Here, I can show you, because we're in this terrible zone, so I don't super care. Uh, here we go. Mm, why am I going to the halls? Let me just go to, like, Far Oasis or something, whatever.
So this is this is the mosaic sin, and she just murders everything. And it's just all all of the attacks. Uh. We can build up more as well if we want, just to make it even more of an explosion. What am I casting? Everything. I am casting all of her martial arts skills. At once. <laughs> Stall. So, it just, it's ridiculous. She can do up to players 2,000 or higher. She could go as high as we could set it. She was able to, to kill. Again, the hammered in and charge strike Javazon made it to like players 64 before they really started to struggle. Maybe they could kind of do like players 100-ish. And she was blowing those out of the water like it was players three or something. Where's the Midora? I don't know. On an arguably worse scared character, yeah. I mean, that one right there was very well geared. That I just showed you. That's my level 99 perfect geared uh, mosaic. So that's, that's pretty peak of her power, but... Though honestly... I'm sure like, you know, mixing in a J mod or something would really help it, but... Everything everywhere all at once. That's what that movie was named after, The Mosaic Assassin. A lot of people don't know that. Fun fact. Can you adjust the brightness of her spells? No. You just have to suffer through the eye pain. I can't kill. So yeah, she just she just was too much. So in her first debut season, I where I had been like, yo, this seems like it's probably gonna be too good. I made her and took her to 99, and she was too good. And so then after you know playing her for a couple of, you know hundred something hours, whatever, to 99. I was like, yo, Blizzard, she needs a nerf. And then everybody was like, oh, Mr. Llama, you suck. You just want to nerf it now that you got to enjoy it and play it. You just don't want the rest of us to have fun with it. Leave it be. Like, what kind of weird motivations do you think I have? 
<laughs> I just want the character to not be the most broken thing ever. <laughs> it's terrible. But to be fair, it's probably a bunch of Diablo 3 players or something. They were like, this feels perfect. Finally, a unique. Good lord, haven't seen a unique in forever here. I mean, that's true, Celine. Hi, Llama. Will you do stuff like MVS? Yes, in one week. One week. September 29th. September 29th, 30th, and 31st is our first three day Manverse stream to Ubers. That's right. We're gonna try something new, something wacky and wild here. And my birthday's also in uh, five days. So we'll kind of have like a little birthday celebration. Maybe, you know. Llama gets a bunch of free pieces of gear every minute because it's his birthday. Twenty sixth, yes. How does it work? Is there a way we can help you? Yes, there is if you gift helps. Every four ninety nine, you can you can say helping llama with the four ninety nine, and then uh, I can use those helps to get gold, to slow down some punishments, whatever stuff. And if Evo ever fixes Guardian Angel, then you could also Guardian Angel. Sorry, Friday, September 29th, 30th, and then October 1st. Got an ohm rune? Let's go, baby. I had money for that, but I had to sub this month for sound. No, uh, sa sound came with the stream. Can I save up now for a saving cut right before Lilith dies? Mm -hmm. So I'm not, I'm still thinking on it. Is save and quit. Should I disable save and quit in the Uber's areas? Otherwise, I mean, that's brutal. You know. It, it, it feels like that probably needs to be done. Like once portals are open, save and quit disappears. I mean, it does feel like we could, ah. Because, yeah, having to refarm nine keys over and over again. Yeah, that's the problem. Eth? Yeah. So that one probably has to be. 
You can Remove use there. Did you know that? Wow. You can, can you? Unless there's a way that people can like gift me keys or something, you know. <laughs> At your service. Yeah, save and quit during mini Uber is allowed, but then I can pull new keys from a shared stash. Something like that. So then I'm just redoing the actual fight. I think that would that would work. Though, I, I don't feel like, you know, I feel like if I get a, a solid, like, you know, ah, uh, but I guess, hmm. Hmm, okay, I have to think about this. We can make it like, if, like, if I want to make it quote unquote easy for myself, I can just remove save and quit and I can remove dropping gear but and so then it's just like the effects and whatever but I like the idea of having keys where I can just redo it but I do think I have to have some gear prevention of removal otherwise it will never have any chance right like if I can't have you know open wounds and crushing blow there is nothing I can do in that fight or harmony right So the thought probably comes down to what we need to do is limit it yeah we probably just need to limit it so it's like all right I can have you know two or three pieces of gear Oh, we should probably do it like we've done before, where if I, uh, I can, like, lock a piece of gear by doing nil attack. And if I name a piece of gear, then it's locked. That's probably the best way. That way I can lock in, like, a black rune word. And then, like, a, you know, open wounds belt or something. Yeah, and then I can have up to three max, and then we can do save and quits, but I can, if you save and quit me there, I don't have to refarm the keys. Alright, that sounds, that sounds solid. Glad we talked about it. Good job, chat. Named gear and redeemed 25 helps. Wow. Chat agreed to all of it. Thanks, chat. All right, let's let's be done with this area. Let's go to Travancore. Can't just make him sell keys at vendors. 
I mean, yeah, if we played in, like, the modded versions of it. Drop all gear right before he talks to Anya. Wow. Really mature. Uh, traffic call. There we go. Oh, uh, you, you you know what the order is for uh, single player terror zones. You can look ahead and oh my god, my mercenary got popped. Wait, am I still on players three? No, I'm on players one, right? There's one. Do I have a dwarf somewhere? Do not. That's nice. 37 life, 8 auras. I mean, I found two today that I threw away. I, I have dwarfs on, uh, on like mules, yeah. I just wonder if I had one in here at all. door from the top row? I don't think so. Yes. No, that was SOJ. Just a trashy SOJ. Gross. Ah, oh, seven items left. I'm, I'm so happy we got one from Terrazone Andy. I mean, again, just her drops are just insane. We didn't just get. some basic stuff from her. We got er, uh, Cranium Basher, Ghost Flame. I 
Executioner's Justice. That's wild, man. I am overburdened. Veil of Steel. Five unique rings. Yeah, it's always a really fun mech. The Ashutas drop, like... It's crazy. Absolutely craziness. Oh boy, who's got that aura? There we go. Are there item filters? Not built into it. Terra's and Andy can drop every item if you're high enough level, yeah? Winged Harpoon Rare. Ugh! So close. If only that was unique, man. We would have had a double today. Yeah, just a loot pinata. Sorry to hear that, Brian. That is, uh, not, not fun. Wishing the best for you. Can't believe we're gonna make it through this entire stream. Welcome to the full stream, gang. Glad you're uh, enjoying it. I can't carry anymore. Full stream costs five dollars. <laughs> no, it, it's free. The stream is free. Good lord. <laughs> no. What's wrong with you guys? YouTube voice is extra. Same, same voice. Same exact voice. Who's got this aura? I need it gone. There it is. Oof. You remember seeing me find Mang Song's lesson? Ever seen Happier Man Live? Well, I found it again yesterday. But I already had it this time, so. Lost the, uh. Bazinga of it, you know. You need another screen so you can play at the same time? Oh, yeah. That is totally the way to go. That's totally the way to go. Hang out and watch, and play. Do I think Terriels will be the last item this time? Yeah. It it feels like that. Last time I found Terriels might at 17. Really early, technically, into the grail. This time we're down to seven, and a lot of the seven isn't even hard. Like Nell Striker, I can get whenever I want. Haas, I can get whenever I want. Help me, donating for full stream. Thank you, Bukola, but it's. Remember, it's not like a requirement. Five dollars for full stream, just you know. But thank you. So really, and even like Gargoyle's Bite, easy to find. 
really it's just Astrians, Tyrials, and you know, kind of Wisp a little bit. Guys, please. The stream is free. Sound is five dollars, though. Don't charge for sound either. Everybody gets sound. Just in case anybody's watching and wondering. It's all, all free. You just come and sit down and enjoy as much as you want. And you're good. If you choose to donate or subscribe or something beyond that, well, it's all appreciated. It technically is what keeps the streams rolling and everything, you know. But, uh... Yeah. Quick Riju farm in here. Yeah, we're doing PD2 tomorrow with Gymnasium, Lucky Luciano, Senpai. The other people. I don't think so. You say I won't be playing? Yeah, we'll do PD2 Mon or Friday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Yeah, because then I'm off Wednesday. Thursday is Diablo 2 ladder reset. Which... Maybe we'll do that reset, and if I'm having a blast with PD2, maybe I'll do PD2 Thursday as well. Then Friday, Saturday, Sunday is member stream. Uh, something binary. Can I give you lesson? You need it for Grail. Sure. Come, come and get it. I'll drop it right here for you. What's man vs. stream? Uh, Llama tries to beat the game and chat tortures Llama along the way and makes it as impossible as they can. That is it. You're welcome, Pioneer. Never seen one of those before? But they're terrible. Eventually, I had to take like a two year break from them because mentally they were so brutal. And you sit there and think, oh, Mr. Llama, 
How could you not just suck it up and do it, whatever, blah, 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 blah. I don't think you understand how frustratingly brutal it is. <laughs> yeah, it's just P1 Trev. I wish I could do higher right now, but this wouldn't be the character for it, honestly. Takes years off your life. Man vs. Steam to try and reach level first level 99. That wouldn't work. <laughs> Is it really frustratingly brutal after you look at your bank account though? Yep. Again, yeah, it's it. Uh, you know, at times it's done very well, but the the mental tax is quite high from it. There you go, Kier. It, it is essentially a form of torture, you know. So, it's like at some point, even if somebody pays you a lot of money being tortured, at some point you're like, mm, I don't feel like being tortured right now. I know it's good money, but I, I just don't want to be tortured. But you know what I do want? Where's projector? It's like a normal job. Yeah, but but somehow so much worse. Send me back to the office to listen to Bill talk about his wife or, you know, and kids. Well, I'm just trying to do my work. Just don't, don't make me have to try and play this game while the game is getting slap chopped and Vince is selling me an item. You know. Meetings about meetings to review meetings or man versus stream. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, they're different, you know? The problem with corporate meetings, you know, we need to have a meeting to discuss when we're going to have a meeting and review the previous meeting we had is, you know, that's kind of a long drain, right? Like, when you're in the corporate world, nothing is really an immediate awfulness that you need to get away from. It's all just, yeah, over the course of years and years of having meetings about meetings and all the corporate buzzwords and all that stuff, it just slowly beats you down into... Just, you know, ugh. sadness and depression. Whereas Man vs. Stream is about instant torture. Trayvon Diggs, torn ACL, out for the year? What? No! This, this is our year though.
No, what? Bro, we j all we needed for it to be our year is to avoid injuries. That's it. Exactly, acoustic. Yeah. Brutal, man. Injuries, injuries, injuries. Always. Football is just too brutal. There's just so many injuries, man. It's insane. The thing that connects the top and the bottom, yeah. One of those ones, probably. Cryptic Axe at... Classic arrow to the knee. Eh, three open socket. 214. Oh my god. Can't take. Yeah, that's really too bad. Every single one of your running backs got injured in fantasy t this week. Yeah. That's the other thing about playing fantasy. But there's too many injuries. It's like, oh, yeah, like I I snagged Chubb and I snagged blah, blah, blah. And that's like, they're out fully. Oh, God. <laughs> People just getting blasted losing your first, second round pick and your season's just toast. Then you're just preying on some random shots, you know. Middle of the season. Unique ring! You know what I love, everybody? I love that while it took us nine, yes, nine different unique rings today, we finally found a grail item with projector. I was ready to find it. Let 
me be done with these unique rings already. Still have two. Uh, you'll get more drops that will be gold drops, so it won't increase the amount specifically, but you'll get more quantities of them dropping. I'm pretty certain that's how it'll be. This is my second grail, correct. I am I can't carry that is correct. I can't carry Do donuts count? I want some donuts. You giving donuts to everybody, or what's up? Sharing with the class? Curse for Nabs isn't nasty. In lieu of a ten dollar charge for first SOJ drop viewing. I mean nine unique rings today. You would hope that one of them would, would pop off, but I don't include the runes in my grail, but I've found every rune, so if we did, then I would have them all. Now full runeward grail, oof, that sounds gross. Is the Grail gonna be this fun and long RPG? I hope it's fun. People enjoy it. Uh, we just have to see how a uh, long RPG comes along overall with stuff, you know? Sound gonna be an MTX and Lama RPG. Sound is not a microtransaction for this stream. Oh my gosh. Well, I've been needing voice actors in Lama RPG. You know, probably eventually. Right? Like. But I don't know, it's also animals, so I don't know if I should make the animals actually say words, you know? Or if that ends up being weird. TBD? But that feels like a finishing touch thing almost, you know? Pokemon does it? 
wow here. Only for like, do they? I mean, the animals just say their names. So you could just make all the animals just say like, horsey horse. But then we're probably too much stealing Pokemon. It will not, Darksider. Pikachu and Detective Pikachu. Ah, that was a great, great film. Shadow Plate again. You just watched it. Yeah, it's like a, you know, it's a fun, silly film for sure. I thought it was nice. Is there a ladder reset tonight? There's a ladder reset in like 20 hours, roughly. Mmm, I highly doubt there will be anything for us on the 28th. I, I don't think they were doing a reverse fake or anything when they said, don't expect any changes this season. I don't think that was them trying to fool us into letting our guard down and then blasting us in the face with some big changes, you know. Like, nah, I'm pretty sure that was them <laughs> saying, we are working on figuring out Diablo 4 still. So we have nothing for you. Wow, epic. For sure, Mr. Sea Dragon. Look, I wish as much as you guys that it was a. Uh... Psych, we actually have Axix, but. It's all just a, a dream. Corona. <laughs> Pillow. I mean, it could have been Astrians, you know? Coulda, shoulda, woulda. Not in town. Or Wisp. So many nice items that we need. But we found one today. So we, we knocked one grail item out. Which, when you have eight items left, 
finding a single item in a day, even if it's a medium one, always a nice day. No hives yet. Yeah, I figured maybe Andy or something would give it to us. She's like pretty good odds, but. Would be my Mang songs less than this grail? I mean, probably Tyrael's might, right? This, this is our most likely here. Especially since we haven't found it now. And again, really this list is pretty uh, weak, you know. Like, Gargoyle's Bite? Easy. BK Ring? Should be easy. Wisp might take a little bit. Nell Striker? Haas? Easy. So really we're just saying is Astrian's or is Tyrael's going to be my last item with maybe some potential that it's like Wisp is my thoughts. And that, that leads us to believe probably Tyrael's most of the time, statistically. Tyrael's probably has like a 60 to 70% chance of it being the last item based on these items that we have remaining. Wow, Dark Sider. I feel like I have to ban you. Hello. Your last items are Metal Grid and Mang Songs. Yeah, the the amulets and rings can just be weirdly sneaky sometimes. And then Mang Songs, there you go. I know that pain. I know that pain. Dang, Skippy. I found two ravens today. You drop metal grid three or four times now? I think I have two metal grids on this character. But yeah, like my other grail, I had an okay amount of it for sure. Is it going to be worth playing the patch? I mean, there's no changes, so... If you're wanting changes for when you play it... No. Good lord, Ukfai. No extra character slots! No nothing, man. It's really brutal. You're at max characters, 24, yep. Yeah, that's like, I hate that so much. You expect me to play every season? And over five seasons, 24 characters? I can't even have mules anymore. That's how awful it is. I 
And I probably have a couple mule spots. Go take a look in a second. But yeah, a lot of my characters have like GG gear on them, but they're just sitting around holding it. Just just big mules. Okay, so I have the fire source mule and the craft mule. And that's it. Everybody else. And then a couple play along characters. What game should you play? Exclamation mark RPG Discord. Get ready and excited for Lum RPG. Those names are boring. Thank you. Up, Alexander. Good to see you, bud. Hope you had a nice stream. Thank you, thank you. Like the Eric interview? Yeah, it was it was fantastic to do. He was super cool. Plus it was awesome having just like Phil Shank and Peter Hugh and all these all these guys just like hanging out in the chat. So we just had a bunch of dope people there. Chat was absolutely stacked. Llama, I can't afford this month's rent. I mean sub. What? <laughs> it's not rent! <laughs> Jesus. And yes, of course I understand. If you can... If you cannot afford this month's sub... Do not subscribe to me. Go and get yourself taken care of. Get yourself in a good spot. Then come back and then sub. Easy. What if I can't afford it, but I'm very lazy? No excuse. Get that sub in. <laughs> Beans! Yeah, I mean, I have dealt with people in the past 
who were like, I can't sub, I'm sorry. And then, like, they're like, I'm not going to watch the stream anymore because I, I feel bad about it. It's like, what? Just, just don't sub then. Hang out. I don't, I'm perfectly fine. I don't get, like, offended. And I am very much do not want you to subscribe if you cannot afford to subscribe. We do not only take paying customers here. Can't validate, sorry. Oh my god. <laughs> Benny Caker with 10 months. Mwah. Thank you so much. And it is September, this is true. So if you were considering subscribing, doing so in Septem September does have a nice discount. But. Again. That is if you can afford it. If not, no shame. No worries. Feet finder. Hmm. Is there a recent secret only fans nope yeah I'll be on the PD2 launch tomorrow ooh gilded shield almost a highs for us hey, yeah I don't got the only fans I'm sorry to say I mean, that, that's specific to you, though, Dark. Can you watch the PD2 stream here? You will be able to, yes. In like 20 hours, we'll be streaming. And we'll be streaming PD2. Seems like good content for it here. Ouch! Who's got the conviction aura? Ishmael does. You always know when there's conviction because your mercenary just dies instantly. Gonna play any crazy builds? You're gonna try out Barb Warren with Deep Wounds. Ooh, that seems nice. I was I was playing uh, Frenzy Barb in beta, but uh, or I mean Throw Barb, like Frenzy Throw. But I think I'm gonna go try out Paladin. Maybe try like the Holy Sword or something. Mm. Seems interesting. Four open socket scepters. What kind of scepter are you looking for there? 
I mean, generally just like killing cows, killing lots of stuff with low, low magic find. Pig Pen with 17 subs? What? Wow. My goodness, Pig Pen. My goodness. <laughs> Just unlock that audio. No. Dark Wader. Ah, oh, Sacred Armor. Dark with the gifted sub to Shardjillo as well. But my goodness, Pig Pen. That is. Insanely generous. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Seven to people who don't have to skip meals this month. That's nobody. The moments badge. I still don't even know what a moment is on Twitch. I do not understand how a moment is different from a clip. <laughs> Perfect gear. That sounds moment worthy to me. Sure, but what is it? It's a special clip. But like, what is special about it? What's... You have to be there in the moment to understand? Oh my god. So, does your specific badge link to a specific clip? Is that what it is? Oh. Okay. I see now what they were going for with it. Gotcha. The badge levels up based on how many moments you've been in. Oh, like Pusaroni has a tier 2 moments badge. And then I can see the moments that she was a part of. Ah. Huh. Okay. That's actually kind of cute. So the better question then is, who determines what's a moment? Because I haven't been saying this is a moment. Mods make moments? So mods could totally abuse this and just like moment everything while they're there.
Yes, but five a month. They each mod can only make five a month. Whoa. Dark waiter with three gifted subs. Wow. Five in total? Her channel? Whoa. That's not a lot of moments. You want the color on your gift box? It looks good. It looks good on you. Sorry about digs, bro. I'm I'm heartbroken. This is our year, and already the injuries are starting to try and shut it down. Is this a moment when we first understood moments? Probably. Yeah, apparently Diggs uh, is out for season now. Tore something in his knee. Greetings. And I'm devastated. Short-lived, wow. I mean, look, the defense is still really solid, but I just don't want to start the injury train, you know? Oh my god, the conviction. I need more rejuice. I wish that they would. There'd be rejuice around there. As long as Dak is there, no playoff wins in the future. We won a playoff game just last year, Billy Bones. In case you forgot. New season starts the 28th. In case you forgot. No, we had uh, terrors on Andy, so she really did us up to start. Wow. It's okay to admit that you're just, you're scared of the boys. Found two griffins in the last tears on Andy. Jesus. That'd be fun, Tesla. They have a defense to rely on and their only fans is decent? Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying though. I if the offense has a couple, you know, mishaps here and there, all right. But don't don't hurt my uh, my defense, man. 
We need to keep that threat there. Keep the threat alive. Thank you, Viking! Appreciate it. Welcome back. 44 months. Should I trade Pollard and Fantasy before he gets hurt too? Don't you dare put that on us. Pollard is going to be a nice, fine, happy, healthy boy all season long. That's that. It's my favorite monster in D2. Man, it's tough. I mean, honestly, so many of them are just amazing. Like, the design of so many monsters, the various speeds they move at, the various effects they have. I know it'll be harder in Lama RPG because it's a turn-based game and that's like a little bit harder to really get quite as much identity, but I, I hope I can get even half the identity in Lama RPG that all the monsters in D2 have. It's, it's spectacular. How's my baby? She's doing well. Is Lama RPG built using Unity? No. I said let's go with Unity. And my uh, a couple of the other people that were doing some dev stuff, helping out, were like, eh, maybe we don't do Unity. Let's look at Godot. And I was like, I don't know. I think we should do Unity. And then... Somebody, one of them linked the uh, Unity, like mobile, what was it? It was some shady mobile deal they made. What was it exactly? But essentially they made a deal with some like shady mobile company that installs like malware on phones yeah they are yeah they acquired the malware company and at that point i was like okay let's let's not do it because that that is weird it's a really weird strange move and it definitely made me concerned about uh the future you know it's like when when a company starts doing that stuff you're like oh they're starting to enter their like anything to be greedy and make money phase so they're willing to do anything and then sure enough a year later they're like surprise we're greedy and horrible. So. They didn't just buy it, they merged with them. Yeah, I, I knew it was something weird. Like that. So. Whatever they did with them, it was it was enough to convince me away from them. And like I said, I'm just really glad uh, that we did. So now we're on Godot, where we wait 
to hopefully never have to deal with that stuff. Yeah, it's spelled the same way. Foul S. You said recently I had to start porting your game out of Unity. Yeah, I mean that's probably with uh, where how how I would do it. I think with how like disgusting they're being right now, I wouldn't trust to keep it in. I I, I would port it over. Is UE too expensive? Unreal is well. I'm making a 2D game, and Unreal is better for 3D. Um, it's like too complicated for 2D, really. But yeah, just like too complicated, too much stuff for for it. I, I don't need all of the Unreal Engine for my game. So, that's all. UE is a bad engine. I mean, it's... I wouldn't say it's amazing, but it's not bad. And the 3D is really nice, which is its big thing. But, like, a lot of games are, are being made with Unreal now. And so I think people are getting a little tired of seeing the same, like, issues. But I think it's a good engine still. But it's not perfect. But three, if you're making a 3D game, it is, like, the engine to use right now for sure. Blizzard Sork and I'm having a hard time in hell with all the cold immune. Would uh -huh. picking up some lightning tree points work? Or should I go Hydra? I'd say go fire. Lightning, you just need too much, too many skills working for you. Go fire and grab some Hydra or something like that. It won't be perfect, but it'll be something. I've got like a Frozen Orb Hydra hybrid build, I'm pretty sure, on exclamation mark guides. But you can also run Blizzard Hydra. It's also fine. And then, yeah, for for those cold immunes, it'll just take a little bit for them, because it's not your like main damage source. But And you can also, of course, not kill everything, but there are still some cold immunes you'll have to kill, so... Generally, if you're going to be pure cold playing through, it, it's pretty tough without a Sunder Charm or anything. Blizzard Hydra equals Blyjard. But, yeah, Long RPG is coming along well still. We are... It's taking longer than expected in, in different areas. Um, I shouldn't say than expected, than, than predicted. I expected it to take longer than I expected. Because <laughs> that's just, you know, it's my first time doing this, so... So, you know, it's usually how that stuff goes. Um, so, I'm, I'm not, like, really concerned with any of that. But, yeah, we're just getting, you know, getting pieces together with it and running into problems and solving those problems and figuring stuff out. But we've got a lot of skills implemented. We've got a lot of, uh, if not all the skills for the most part. 
We've got items implemented and their generation. We have like monster, but it, it's gen it's in a way where like I can spawn a monster right now to fight. And I could kind of set some parameters for some basic stuff, but we still have to put in like a full, you know, okay. When you're in this area, these are the types of monsters that can spawn. And this is the levels that they'll spawn with and all of that. Like, you know, it's not, it's not fully built, but a lot of the core system of it is built. So that's the like important good part about it, right? The important part is, can I generate a monster? And that monster have all the right resistances and all that stuff. Once that piece is done, then, you know, it's just building in a small system to make that a random effect that occurs and, you know, is in the right areas and stuff, so. Will there be in-game cutscenes? Uh, probably not a lot if there are. Low budget game funded by, you know, <laughs> exactly, Flub. Release state in mind. It should easily come out in twenty twenty four. I would be very shocked if it did not. Now, even within that, you know, I, I, I think it won't be completely fully finished, but it'll be something that's releasable in, you know, an early access state. And I generally don't really like early access, how it gets used. But I do kind of like it in this manner a little bit. Because it'll be a game where basically I'm going to say, Hey, I'm going to do demo, alpha, beta, you know, whatever. We'll just keep doing multiple instances of that where people can come in and test things and you know, help us figure out what's working, what's not working, all of that. It'll be a very open, engaged talking experience. And then once we have that kind of set, essentially I'm just gonna wait until one of the times when I'm doing the like, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna shut down the beta. I'm gonna wait until everybody says, don't do it. Like, no, I'm having way too much fun right now. Don't, don't close it. Can we keep it open? And at that point, I feel like is when we'll know, okay, the game is now at a fun enough point and a, a good enough point where we can kind of keep it open and launch in the early access and then just add a bunch of stuff on to that. You know, because there will be a lot of like additional things that I, I already know I want to add into the game that won't be right in the base launch. But there'll be things that'll be really, you know, areas and whatever things to, that'll be added in. So. Well, RPG have a rune word type system. Currently, there's no rune words. I mean, that feels too like straight copy off Diablo. Um, but there will probably be that. That's something I'm looking at for again, like a future. I don't think that'll be in base. Um, but I, I, I think looking there, that'll be something you know, future-wise. I will look at it and say. Okay, what else can I do with items? And I think something like rune words is an easy additional thing you can add in, right? Right, so we'll copy Diablo and add rune words in an update, but probably again in their own way, right? 
it's not just going to be a direct copy of Runewords. I actually wouldn't even want a direct copy of Runewords. I think they need some uh, fixing in some ways. But the itemization should also hopefully trend more towards um, crafting and crafted items. That should be a, a larger piece of the items that you're going after and hunting and such, so... There's already kind of more availability there than uh, I think even like D2 has. Just because D2 crafting kind of sucks. Yeah. Diab Diablo 2 crafting is like super basic and un underdeveloped. So, LOM RPG's crafting system is actually pretty advanced in my opinion. I think it's going to be one of the most fun systems uh, the game has. Will it have mercenaries? Um, not to start. Again, something that can be added in in the future. But no, no mercenaries to start. It's not browser-based, but honestly, I think it would play in a browser fine. I'm going to look at making a mobile app sometime in the future. I actually think it would be a great mobile game. Because, again, it's a turn-based game. So you don't need to have, you know... Games that aren't turn-based, I feel like, ugh. On phones, they just never end up being that, that great. But, like, chess, I love it on my phone. Except when I'm in a time scramble. You know, it just, it, it plays super great there. So I, I think mobile will actually be, you know, a big, great spot for it, but... I want to first create the game on PC and build it for PC and have it be fully PC functional and not a mobile game that's on PC because those always still just feel like mobile games, you know? The UI and all that stuff, it just doesn't quite feel right. So I want to avoid that and make the game really a, a PC game there and then create a mobile port and then within that mobile port create a new mobile UI for it and all that. Yeah, I mean it's just, there's, there's a lot of them. There's a lot of mobile games that are on PC And they just, they just feel fully mobile. It's like, you guys didn't update this at all. Wow! We were just talking about griffins. A bunch today. My goodness, what a day. We were just talking about it. Title checks out? Yeah. Yeah, the title the title checks out for sure. What do you think? 2015? Casual 2015, maybe? <sighs> Wrong tab. Ooh! Ooh! Just off! Huge, though! Wow! 1914 Griff. Just barely missed. Wow, what a what a drop. Less than three. Nineteen fourteen Griffins. The Sofji, thank you. 
Renegade Ronin, thank you. Oh yeah, that, that baby gets a facet for sure. They get a facet for sure. Wow. Yeah, because my current one is like not that great. Let me go check. Let me go check. Oh my god, what? Sixteen twelve? Come on, there's got to be... Too many characters. Where's my Javazon? Just a hacked one. I need to delete those. Rainbow. Uh, there she is. Good lord. Oh, she just has Shaco on. Does she have a Griffins in her stash, though? No, okay. Those are nice. So many gems, good lord. So, huge upgrade! Let's go, baby! Absolutely huge. Just a nice and easy Griffins. I mean, I was telling you guys before, Griffins drop like candy too. I need a key. Now we gotta get this dang gargoyles bite. Whatever the heck that is. I mean, we got Executioner's Justice today, so we did, we did end up landing a, a Holy Grail item, so that was nice. But with how easy half of our list is, I'm hungry for more. Never seen a Horizons tornado? What? Surely you've seen that. Yep, we just been running Terror Zones all stream. Yeah, the Terra Zones are fantastic. I mean, some of them, like uh, that last one, or two ones ago, was are, are just absolutely awful. But... 
There are some good ones, including, of course, Endariel. So good. That ancient sway wasn't even worth it. I mean, it might be worth it to just, like, not really go down into the Icy Cellar. But Icy Cellar is so disgusting. That, yeah, it's hard to, hard to be worth it. It feels so bad. Ghost. Mana burn, so annoying. What's Chaos Armor? Uh, is Trang's Chaos Armor? That sounds right to me. Sounds right to me. P1 Hork is better than Horking a higher player count. Yeah, so the thing about Horking is monsters that you care to Hork, which are the unique and champion mobs, uh, will only have a... Uh, they, they always will drop one item and two and four potions champions will drop two potions and when you hork them then you get that same drop chances and that is regardless of player count so if you're only killing the bosses then it it, it doesn't actually benefit you at all now the more that you're killing other mobs, the more benefit you're going to see from making those sorts of, you know, killing more mobs, having a higher player count, all of this. And if you're also horking other mobs as well, it kind of slows you down, but you could on like a high player's count, but yeah, really the, the best way to magic find, especially these kinds of items, is just go ham on just the the bosses and then hork the boss and ignore the rest So oh, that is your best, best way to quick pound a lot of dudes, essentially. What about rune drops? Rune drops killing mass amounts on high player counts is your best bet. So I don't run this build for rune drops. I run, you know, my players eight Nova Sorceress or my Poison Necro, or Charge Strike, you know, Lightning Fury, Javazon. Run those guys for that. And then you just want to kill as much stuff as you possibly can. Magic Find doesn't matter for runes, so you just... Go. Just found a perfect D-Web. How much is it worth? A lot. Is it perfect perfect or just perfect? As in is the life and mana per kill perfect perfect? Okay, then it's worth a ton. 
If it was ethereal, even more, but that's just style. I'd be asking, like, I don't know, 40, 50 jaw for it or something. When's the next grind to 99? Probably when I don't have a, a baby. Having an infant, though, makes it uh, pretty brutal to do. Giant grinds. I'm not saying we can't do one, you know, in the next 18 years or nothing. I'm just saying. While we're still waking up in the night and such. That's true, Kier. Skiller? Since I'm already up at night, I can use that time to grind. True. I'm just not sure how excited Moo Girl would be for me to be like, all right, I'm gonna take the next five days off to go grinding. And do nothing else. Like, even during Manver's stream, like, you know, in between, in the nights, I can change diapers and do stuff. When you're grinding for first 99, do any of that. Unless we did a slow slow push, you know. Do 99 over like two or three weeks. Take it easy. Alright. It is dead o'clock. Yeah, it should be worth a lot, Circolino. That's what I would ask. I mean, it could be worth more, it could be worth a little, a little less, but I think it'll be worth a ton. Take a look at these items again. We got a Grail item. Cranium Basher, Ghost Flame, Veil of Steel, Lasseter, Cold Flacet, Raven Frost, 320 20 Ashutas, Gull Rune, Tomb Reaver, Grid's Helm, and a 1940 Griffins. That's insane. Absolutely insane. Complete ownage of a day. I told you we were finding GG items today, and that list does not disappoint whatsoever. Could have even been a two grail item day, but that's okay. That's okay. Regardless, kisses to you all. Thank you guys for being here. Do not forget to follow if you haven't already. And, uh, yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. PD2 will be on, so we will be grinding through that. We'll be grinding through, having fun playing through PD2 with the group. Peace, everybody. Have a nice one.